your contract. You're still a little weirded out when there's an overlapping showing. You're still upset when the front door was unlocked. But I'm not shocked about it. I'm not mad at my agent about it. I want to make sure that we're then being proactive so it doesn't happen again. Does that make sense? So our process overlay is our first level of expectation, and that's for any client, for a buyer, for a landlord, for a tenant, for a seller. They each have a set of expectations. The second part then is negotiation. The second part now is the most, the most precise to you. If you had your dream world, you could wave your wand and every buyer would negotiate and do things in a certain manner, what would it look like? What would be the defining pieces of evidence that we would make decisions on? How would we react during inspections? How would we feel about our financial documentation and, and readiness? How would we deal with rounds of negotiation and people and humans? How would we deal with all of it? Because if you want it to be that way, start teaching them to do it that way. But you can't do it in the moment. Once that emotion is there, once the expectation isn't met, or once I'm already thrilled and going, as soon as my right brain says I desire something, Everything is now either for or against me. Everything. Every opinion, every comment, every piece of information, my left brain is either viewing as a pro or a con, automatically based on my right brain firing. That's a tough place to be in. So if I want to frame that differently, I've got to teach you up front. Remember when I started this whole thing, I said, you can be the best negotiator on the planet, it doesn't matter. Literally, it does not matter because you are not the one negotiating. Your client is. The best negotiators in real estate are the best teachers. They know how to teach the client how to be successful with the system that they know to be successful. And so that means helping them understand how do we determine price? Comps, numbers, analysis. How do we argue our position? Logic, rationale, reasons. How do we deploy tactics in negotiation? Based on results, 